Uh, Antigua and Barbuda has had a very robust economy. As you know, we are located in the Western Hemisphere. And for the last five years, we have achieved um, growth rates in a region of 5% per annum, which makes Antigua and Barbuda one of the fastest growing economies in the Western Hemisphere. In fact, um, our performance would have exceeded um, the global average growth. But we recognize now that uh, based on the trade war that is taking place between the United States and China, that we could see a slowdown in global trade, which obviously would impact growth in all countries. So we're now trying to see how we could mitigate against that impact and to broaden our relationships to include a closer relationship with uh, the Russian Federation. And that is one of the reasons why I'm here, to strengthen the bilateral relations between both our countries. We have a citizenship by investment program. It is a, an immigration investment um, program in which we incentivize investments using Antiguan and Barbudan citizenship. So someone who makes a contribution to a development fund of 100,000 US dollars or an investment in a business of 1.5 million US dollars or if they purchase real estate in the amount of 400,000 US dollars can become a citizen of Antigua and Barbuda. So it is actually an incentive to incentivize more robust um, growth and development within the country and to provide that added value to the investor. To make very important business links, uh, we're trying to grow our tourism product exponentially. We need at least 10,000 new rooms, hotel rooms in Antigua, based on the demand. And we're hoping that we can interest hoteliers here. Uh, we're also very much um, interested in the technological space. We're now transitioning into blockchain technology and crypto and digital, digital currencies. So broadening our network and capabilities is very important. Plus, we obviously are interested in seeing what is happening at the cutting edge of technology. So the exhibition is also very important to get insights into the technological advancements, especially in ICTs.